seen the photos of, of Nazim on the plane. Um, it's been a, I mean, a long ordeal, but obviously the last couple of days where we've not been speaking, um, it's been very up and down, and it's been getting closer and closer, and, and things moved on Sunday. Uh, so Sunday is when Nazim got given her passport back. Um, and we have been bewildered ever since trying to work out is this sort of an incremental game of cat and mouse still, or is it all moving forwards? Um, and we spent all morning with the sitting in the airport, um, not knowing what was going to happen. Um, promised to keep silence to everyone. So, I mean, a huge relief. Huge relief that, that she's on a plane, that she's coming home, that she's free. And thank you to everyone who's been helping along the way. It's been a long journey that people have been keeping us um, following it on the news, on the petitions with the government. Um, I've said some rough things over the years, um, but in the end, she's coming home. Like we were just saying, you know, last night, Gabrielle was asking me, is, is Mummy really coming back tomorrow? I said, well, I don't, I don't know for sure. I think we're close to her. Um, I mean, I now know pretty surely she is coming home. Um, and of course, you know, it, it's a happy sunny day. It's also, there'll be plenty of rain to get through and, and um, challenges ahead. And six years apart is a long time for any family. It's not sunny, right? <laughs> And, and to this point, we've been kept out. We've been behind closed doors with the lawyers. We've been checking, well, is it? Is it? So I, I, don't, I don't know what's happened. I've seen briefings and so on. I mean, I'm relieved that the problem's resolved. Um, I think the government has two jobs. Protect people in situations like this to make sure it doesn't happen again. Part of that is to doing what you need to do to get people home. And part of that is to making sure those who took that learn the lesson not to continue doing that. Um, that second part is for another day. Uh, but for today, I'm, I'm really glad for the way things are. It's a recovery process. You can't get back the time that's gone. Um, that, that's a fact. Um, but we live in the future, not the past. So, so you know, we'll take it one day at a time.